to help support this podcast and get exclusive bonus content and rewards, make a monthly pledge at patreon.com slash universe box. And, and remember, remember to, to think, think outside. outside. Greetings from Storybrook. I'm Bill Meeks. And I'm Anne Marie V. Simone. And we're back for another Once Upon a Time Season 1 commentary. Who are we? This we, is the I best know. we have ever done. I know. Well, people might not realize it because we're releasing these, uh, you know, staggered throughout the summer, but we, we're actually, we're only a couple weeks out from our RegalCon live episode, and we're, this we is really like are, our fourth like or fifth <laughs> commentary <laughs> we've recorded. It really so, is. It's kind of so cool. We're really on the ball, uh, which well, is Well, nice. you know, that could be because... Yeah. Our entire <laughs> we're packing <laughs> the show's moving yes the show's moving to orlando uh, more on that later uh but we are doing uh episode uh season one episode 11 tonight uh fruit of the poisonous tree <gasps> that of the uh fruit i have fruit giancarlo espinito zero espinito <laughs> I, f- I don't think that's I the way you pronounce his name. I don't think that's how you do it either. But if you've never uh, done one of these uh, commentaries with us before, what we try to do is, uh, you know, it's just we're talking over the show. Mm-hmm. You should be watching the show. Please watch the while show. You're listening to this. We have listeners who listen to these commentaries without watching the show. And we don't understand. We shun them. We, we, do we not never shun. talk to them again yes, when we, we hear do. this. Just because we don't want to be held liable for their. Disentra- uh, uh, just like dis. Sadness. Connect, disconnecting from the world. Sadness! <laughs> <laughs> but if you do want to watch along with the episode and keep in sync with us and everything, which, by the way, I, on the video <laughs> versions, uh, we, we are doing a little something to where they, there might be some value in watching the video versions at youtube.universebox.com mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Uh, with these, even if you're not watching the episode, because we have like a little st- uh, still from the episode that updates about every 25 seconds. So you have a g- if you know the episode... You might be able to follow it okay. Uh, we'll see. It's a little experiment we're trying. But if you have the episode on DVD, Netflix, whatever, what we're going to do is I'm going to do a three count. Three, two, one, go. Three, two, one, go. And on go, you hit play. And uh, then we're off to the races. And as we get go through the first couple minutes of the episode, we'll call out any on-screen text, you know, cast n- member names, things like I that. I don't know what I'm doing. Sorry. Oh, no, it's fine. You can keep on dancing weird- weirdly back there. Here, I'll put up the flammery cam for them. Um, but yeah, so uh, it just, uh, you know, three, two, one, go. You hit play. And uh, then we're off to the races. We'll uh, read some names, and it'll be all good. Uh, now we always uh, we always have a little magic juice uh, while Dude. we're doing these commentaries. I swear I haven't had that much yet. <laughs> so, uh, Anne Marie, <laughs> what are you drinking tonight? Uh, as far as magic juice, magic juice. This evening I have lemon vodka, uh, blueberry lemonade, um, a couple of frozen blueberries tacked as my ice. And a little splash of bubble water just for entertainment. And uh, as for me, I, I'm doing a Sutter Home Red Blend, which is like a couple different So we reds. call Two Buck Chuck Red Blend. Yeah, basically. And it's like <laughs> the huge bottle, too. Like, so I'm, I'm completely uh, having a lot of fun tonight. Woo! Hey, I'm having vodka. So <laughs> yes. it should be better than the cupcake one. It'll be a good commentary. It'll be a doozy. One for the ages. Drink. We'll drink it again. Okay. Okay, we're going to go ahead and get started here. So uh, get, get your uh, uh, episode, uh, Fruit of the Poisonous Tree, all queued up, ready to go. And we're going to go here. This is the official count in three, two, one, go. Once upon a time. Boom, boom, boom. Thank you. Pretty loud. Pretty loud <laughs> for We us. got it turned down a little. In ABC, ABC Studios, Studios production. production. Some rocks. Jennifer Jennifer Goodman. Goodman. Is Henry on Henry? a bike. Sheriff. Jennifer, Jennifer Morrison. Morrison. Oh, hey, no, kid. the blue jacket. <laughs> no. The blue jacket. I don't know if this is going to be a good episode. It's not going to be good. With that oh, blue... the playground. Raphael Sparge. Oh, Raphael. I hope they put it in a trash bag Robert or Carlo. something. The evil queen. Yeah, it was in a thing. My evil adopted mom. It's still here. Good. <laughs> this is our secret. Where's the apprentice? Oh. 
Oh, he's not cast yet because this yeah. is season one, not season four. Yeah. Henry Carr. It's not a guy. Can you fix a broken heart? Because I have one. <laughs> Help me. No, no. Miss Swan, don't let your feelings grow up to be, be cowboys. cowboys. I'm glad you went with me on that one. I was already there. Oh, excellent. Ian Rather Goldberg and Amber Chambliss? Really? Yeah, <laughs> I'm still doing it. Well, I'll retain everyone else. Soup. <gasps> Good cheese and soup. Mm hmm. And a pickle. Burp. Oh, nice Ooh. phone. The invincible phone of Mary Margaret. <laughs> Isn't that how they defeat Cora in season two? Uh, they they the hit her with the text phone. Message? No, they hit her with the phone, the Nokia phone. <laughs> Just knocks her right out. Oh, hello, who are you? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> hello, Sydney. We meet again. No, oh, he sounds yes, strong. Yes, because this is the uh, this is the Sydney origin story. Oh. As a ruse to do something to you. <laughs> yeah, this must have been interesting for him because right when this was going on was right when he was his character was really breaking and breaking bad. Oh, really? Yeah, so it was like, like you know, he's getting all this critical acclaim while at the same time being on like this primetime network TV show. Yeah. Playing a genie. Playing a genie. <laughs> but he'd filmed that ages before. To be fair, his character in Breaking Bad is just as ridiculous. He's a uh, the, the manager of a chicken restaurant, like a fast food chicken restaurant, slash the head of a meth empire. Oh, my. Here we go. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Wow, he sounds bored. Mm-hmm. He's not too happy about this. Nope. Wonder if he knows Cyrus. I know. From Wonderland. For those of you in the know. Or not in the know. Or not, rather. Who is that? <gasps> That's Snow's I... dad, isn't it? Uh, the, 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 forget that. West Wing. <laughs> oh, he's uh, yes! He's Snow's dad from West Wing. <laughs> <laughs> Snow White's father from the West Wing. It got so, weird around season seven. <laughs> it got really weird around season <laughs> seven. Oh my gosh, it is him. This is crazy. Can't focus. And that earring is from the West Wing. Martin Sheen wore it. <laughs> so it has Notre Dame on it? Oh, uh, he I wished, wish he would be the, free. The freedom. That's nice. Who can it be now? Can it be? Am I truly free? You're the genie. You tell me. Yes, I am. I'm filled with glee. Does he get a second wish, though? Boom. Oh. I wish for more that wishes. That can't be Snow's dad. I thought it was. Because it's been a while. Because I know he ends up with Regina in a second here. I don't in know. a hot second. Hot second. In a genie second. This wish. This wish, this wish, it's possible. See? Juju bees. True <laughs> love. I have someone there you can fall in love with right away. It is my fiance. Watch out, she's kind of manipulative, though. She's not so nice. That's crazy if that's Snow's dad. 
Yeah, because if I remember correctly, spoilers, but oh, I'm no, pretty sure the genie kills Snow's dad. That's how Snow's dad dies. Ah! No wonder I don't really remember him. Oh, my gosh. How do you do? Mm. Look, my hair before it was frizzy. Hmm. I don't remember him from the other episodes, though. And Cousin Lester, <laughs> who was brought in because he's the son of an executive producer. <laughs> uh, bad CGI. That's not a very good outfit for Regina. That's, I like that, it. But it feels like a winter outfit. Well, yes. It, oh, they went uh. the castle. Trivia. They used that wood to build the Jolly Roger. In season two. No, they didn't. I know. It's another one of my fake trivia. I hate your fake trivia. I love my fake trivia. Fake trivia drink. Okay. Actually, you are a villain. You're wrong, and you're a big duty head, Emma Swan. You are not so nice. I don't like you. What? <gasps> what are you doing? Emma throwing shade. Throwing shade. Beep, boop, 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 beep, boop. Hello. How did she dial with those gloves on? <laughs> she has, like, the ones with the little oh, with holes the in the... They didn't have those yet. Did they? In Storybrooke, they did. Ah, uh, magic. Magic. Troll bridge. Ha! Huh? Toll bridge and somebody wrote an R. Yes. It's still fun. <laughs> Follow me. Oh, that doesn't seem positive. Did you find a troll? Did you find a cock? I'm going to kill you. Oh. Aww. Magic juice. Magic juice. Drink. Okay. And the baguette. I like a baguette. I will always find you a baguette. It's only day away. Okay, tomorrow. I don't know why I'm speaking with an accent for charming <laughs> here. Does the, uh-huh. accent make, does the accent make you zen? I am pretty sure I am pretty sure me. Right, roll. Meep. Meep. I really hate the blue jacket. Yeah. But not a real blue jacket. That's cruel. Mm-hmm. You Canadians out there will enjoy that joke. I think there's a lot of people who will enjoy that joke. <laughs> what she got, homie? She stuffs her bra when she's feeling really Shh. mean. Fifty grand's a lot for a small town. Mm-hmm. For Storybrooke, it has like one stoplight. Mm-hmm. Obviously, ah, crack in the meter. What? Obviously, not counting the uh, the worth of all the collectibles and gold shop, mm-hmm. which is now in Disney World and Disneyland. It's in both. I believe so. Yeah. Ooh. I want to do this with the red jacket on. Can you wait a minute while I go and change I so I can change. come back and be in my right costume? Yeah. Are you prepared for her wrath? <laughs> and it hurt my feelings. I'm so sad. Oh, The bleed through. Character bleed. <laughs> yeah, they, a little bit. Mm-hmm. A little bit. Tale as old as time. Wrong story. Oh, sorry. I have four flowers in my hair.
and it drives me insane. Can you cover your face, please? Thank you, Emory. Snow, can you also <laughs> cover your face? <laughs> oh, poor Regina. She's so sad. Quite. Quite, quite. What are you? Oh, oh sorry about oh, that. <laughs> you are never going to get that right, are you? Nope, never. Now you do it on purpose, I think. Maybe a little. Err. They don't even know what you're talking about. The theme song played over our ears again. It's not, not on the theirs. track. It's of not course on the track. it's not on the track. Hey, baby. I'm not feeling good because... Do you like apples? Do you like curses? Purple ones, green ones, red ones. Do you like newspapers? What's a newspaper? You'll find out. Do you like mirrors? <laughs> Do you like brief one episode returns in season four? Very, I can hook you up. Very brief. Well, it's, isn't that sort of the way it goes? That's why you have to I erase his memory. Pet my goatee. Why are my lips so red? I didn't put any lipstick on. <laughs> what magic is this? What's this? What's this? There's magic on the stairs. What's this? I don't know anymore. <laughs> hmm. Her hair's really curly. Mm-hmm. Well, I wonder how long they spend on it before every like little scene like this. Because I mean, you like when I see stuff like this, I think of the character just like running over there to go do something. Yeah. But no, she probably sat in a chair for two hours to get that done. Him too. Uh -huh. Sometimes. Especially maybe we should. Storybook. Maybe we should break bad, Emma. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> yep. Give yourself away. There's no. Drink your tea. I like how this is very obviously built on the side of a pre-existing building because mm -hmm. it has like an old side building ad. I love on this the wall apartment. I love it. Oh God! Why would you want to do that? Stuff. Junk. Being mean. Driving Sydney to drink. Uh. Fire. Fire. I have nothing to hide. I am the fire starter. Okay. How about I come back in my red jacket and ask you this again? We'll try this again with the red. <laughs> nice. Hello, buggy bug bug. Buggy bug bug. Is bug, it made bug. of magic? What? I was riffing off that. I know. Yeah, so I was wondering if you'd like to kill me. Name Genie. See, when you said he was from West Wing, I was, I was expecting more uh, political jokes from you throughout the I, commentary. I, I, I'm just entertained.
Ooh. Ooh. Who's Daniel? I don't care. I met a genie. It just says that he had a goatee that needed a trim. I'm not a fool. She went on for several pages about how she prefers a, an unkempt goatee to a well-trimmed goatee like I have. So we just need to find somebody with an unkempt goatee. Oh, genie. wait. <laughs> and an earring and a turban. And a nose for news. <laughs> if Regina's going to cheat on me, then I'm going to cheat on her. I ship uh, King, whatever his name is, in the genie. Uh, genie King. King Genie. King Genie. King G. King G. King G. Hmm. Maybe. Mm. I don't know. I mean, maybe. I bet he's dreamy. Where did I do that one? Oh, yeah. We did already do dreamy. I bet he's genie. <laughs> VU meters represent. And the body. And the body. Except for the body. Who am who I bringing with me? Mm-hmm. Into the woods. Into the woods. Bribes in the woods. Bribes in the woods. Into the woods. Into the woods and get your money now. Hide it from the she's IRS. obviously going to know they're behind. Like, there's not that many people back on the road. <laughs> yeah, and I think they have they, they have the headlights on yeah, too. Yeah, yep, they do. And it's not that dark. Put on the siren too, Emma. Uh oh. Can't stop, won't stop, won't stop till you get enough. Woo! Come on. Into the woods. Jump that log. Mm-hmm. She wasn't even going that fast. I'm sorry, they speak car? I've driven faster in the woods. Mm-hmm. There's a g- 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 ghost over here. Mm-hmm. She's on to us. And there's a signature here. Argina. Argina? <laughs> yes. Because her last name's Gina. Her first name's Ree. She was meeting me. We're kind of seeing each other. It's nothing serious. We didn't want people to know. I ship Rumpel and Regina. Rump Gina. Rump Gina? Rump Gina. <clears throat> what about, let's see, Rumpel? Rimple. Rumble. Uh, Rumble. Dark Queen. But she kind of. Anyway. Yeah. The but Queen I, one. The Queen one. <laughs> uh, young almost, Robert Carlyle. I know. He looks like, like a little boy bright. here. Look at the shirt. Look at the shirt. It's like neon. Very blue. Especially compared to that dingy blue of Emma's jacket. Oh, the jacket. Drink. Freaky drink. Blue jacket drink. Oh, well, that way we'd be trashed. Yeah, basically. Especially season one. Hashtag bring back the blue jacket. Ah, Regina's daddy. For a second, I thought you said Regina's daddy. I was like, no, I don't think so. Deadish.
Dun, 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 dun. You'd think Regina would be mad about him taking an apple from that tree. You would think. It's a complete set of jazzercise tapes. I want my daughter Regina to become a fitness instructor. Jazzercise. <laughs> For you kiddos out there, Jazzercise was a popular uh, line of exercise tapes from the... It's kind of like Zumba. Yeah, a little bit. Ah, the bug. <clears throat> but not the bug from the desk. The vehicle. Yet. No, we're going to go forge them. We're just going to sit on this stoop while we do it. Yup. E V I L Q. I'm the police, Sydney. But see, <sighs> what is her? I keep getting confused as to where this office is. Yeah, like, this seems like it's... It's in her house, mm -hmm. but it's not in her house. In other seasons, it's connected to the police station. Yeah. Oh, Is it? Yes. I, I don't think it's connected to the police station. Uh, it's not in the mayor's house. Yeah. <laughs> My heart. Is. You came here for booze. Hey, Regina. How's it going? <laughs> Emma taking stuff out of your office. It was her the whole time, huh? Magister. I can. I'm a certified carpenter. I can put it back together, too. We'll need a drywall guy. <laughs> drywall guy. Which one of the dwarves is that? Uh, I'm going to go with... Uh, Doc, no. Doc, that doesn't make any it was, sense. That was actually what Stealthy did. Mm. So that's why they have to use uh, stucco instead of drywall in Storybrook. Oh, my gosh. Trivia. No. It's you I like. <laughs> it's the turban on your head. It's the way you're oh, not quite the dead. the shoulder pads. Yes, those are like... Awful. They're like, they're like angle up. They're like designing women. That's what this dress is, designing <laughs> She's like women. She's like Delta... Bur well, it's ABC. Maybe they had it left over in the costuming room. It's Delta... <laughs> It's a McDonald's uniform. What's in the box? What's in the box? Do you have any guesses before it opens? Quick, quick, quick. I got, there's nothing in the box. There's nothing in the box? Okay. That's fair. Oh, <gasps> it's a snake. There's a snake in the box. Of course it's a snake. Oh, there's two snakes in the box. Of course it's two snakes. A viper. Well, you might want to close the lid then. Two bites turns the person into a zombie. Three bites brings them back to life. Four bites makes them a a werewolf. Five oh. bites um, turns them into a giant. Okay, at this point, I don't think there's much body left. Six bites, they become an actual snake, and that's how these snakes reproduce. Oh, they're just trivia. Bite. That's how these snakes reproduce. Six bites.
You Ooh. know, I hadn't thought about that, but that's a really good idea. I hadn't thought about that. You were like brilliant. So brilliant. Okay, let's stop this creepy hug. Go kill the king. We'll talk later. Yeah, because I don't think she's even like kissed him yet, has she? No. Why didn't the snakes attack them? Charming, evil queen. Oh, hello. Hello, August. <laughs> if only he was the author yeah I almost feel like he was meant to be the author then they kind of had to rejigger some things due to things <clears throat> A giant Trojan horse. <laughs> Old Yale Road. Trivia. That's where uh, the Wicked Witch's house is. Warning. Any trivia facts I mentioned during this entire commentary are, are false. Are not real. That's why you have to establish a chain of evidence. You have to go back. You have to get the evidence, then go back and, and reverse it engineer it to make it look like you didn't get it illegally. Exactly. And while you're doing that, change your jacket, mm -hmm. brush your hair. Definitely. Too many curls. Maybe give Sydney a hug. He looks like he needs one. I think Sydney needs more than a hug. Oh. Uh -huh. Sydney needs a purpose in life. She knew about your blue jacket long before it ever showed up in an episode. All your fault. Because it's your fault. And if I don't do it, then no one will, so... Maybe Frederick. I am the only well, member of the going. city council. No. Who are the fairy tale characters on the council? I don't know. <clears throat> Just random villagers? I think so. Rabble, 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 rabble. Hubbub, 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 hubbub. Oh, hello there, Mr. Gold. <laughs> You'll sit down immediately or so help me. You'll sit down immediately or so help me. It's like from Monsters Incorporated. I'm sorry, did you just make a Monsters <laughs> reference? I did. Mm-hmm. Not just a home, a lavish home. A lavish home. A garish home in the woods. But where are most of the townspeople? Why so haven't you bothered to print your last name on your mail placard sitting in front of you on the desk? Miss Mayor. It just says Mayor. It doesn't say Mayor Mills or Mayor Regina. And then I'm going to get this placard updated. Mm -hmm. Pee Wee's Playhouse. But now that Emma ruined it, none of you can play no on it. No one is playing. Especially you, city council.
Now will you please but it change that have jacket? Been a secret. That's I feel car. I feel like it was m- maybe it might have been something else before. Yeah, you think? She got caught. Yeah. She just had it there as a safety. Mr. Gold's like, there go all my playground profits. And I the, was going to charge well, the kids five dollars a piece. Oh, it's like an indoor playground. <laughs> it's going to oh. be a millionaire. Who wants to be a millionaire? Hey, uh, huh. thanks for setting me free, but here's some snakes. Ha! He should still have a wish, right? No, his last wish was to find true love, I think, wasn't it? Uh, was it? Yeah. I don't really. I missed that. We must have been talking. No, no, no. Or something stupid like that. Uh-huh. Those snakes are very phlegmy. No, hi, how do you do that? Hey, snakes, look that way. Seriously, that's exactly what just happened. (laughs) They're like, wait, let's bite this guy. (laughs) Uh Uh-oh. If this scene was in a Japanese show, it would have a very different outcome. Oof. Yeah, you're dead. That's it. Thanks for stopping. <clears throat> That's faster acting than that, those poison plants from uh, Neverland. It was me, dude. I did it. Ha <laughs> ha. I am the one who knocks. Those are the snakes who bite. You are the king who forgives me. Why does he look like a mouse? (laughs) Duh. I should have made a wish. (laughs) Or he said I should have never made the wish. Ah. Which, of course not, because, you know, cost you your life and everything. Mm -hmm. So, makes sense you'd regret that. This could have been so different. I'd like a town roster. (laughs) Har, har, har. Like me. Mm. Johnny Walker walked... 10,000 miles. Oh, uh, this is a commercial? <laughs> yeah, the, Like, yeah. five-minute commercial? Oh, here we go. Then Johnny Walker learned how to make whiskey a second time after he forgot the first time because he drank too much of the whiskey he made. Is no. her necklace the Olympic rings? <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> I caught you, mm-hmm. remember? I was there. The only thing that accusation does, Emma, is breaks my heart. I can't. Okay. <laughs> nope, not gonna happen. Henry. Nope, 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 nope. Not gonna do it. Not gonna do it. <laughs> Ooh. You did not birth him, madam. <laughs> well, Emma did not raise him, madam. Mm. Catch 22. We have quite the conundrum. Three in the bush. Oh, how come nobody ever goes there anymore? That kind of looks kind of crappy and dangerous. Yep, pretty much. Like those big metal spikes yep. with the tips? Yep. Well, it's designed to look like her castle. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm just saying, how did that get approved from the like the zoning board? And why did they put it out in the middle of the woods? Exactly. Uh, 
Now I'm just having fun over here. It's fine. With your your fan. I want to be a part of your world. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> huh? I will always <laughs> find it. It's in this house that hasn't appeared yet in town. But first, I need to find more batteries. Because I didn't hear anything you said just then. Because my batteries ran out. You know what? I'm just going to go get new batteries. Mm -hmm. I'll talk to you later, Henry. Bye. Kiss my grits. What? What? <laughs> it's my Emma impression. That's awful. What is, what is that? That's her catchphrase. Uh, Kiss my grits. Kiss my grits. It's the book, right? Yeah, but who? It's August. That's what I thought. And he's going to put a new page in it, right? If I remember correctly. Uh -huh. I like the bracelet. That's what I was just thinking. I'm like, I like that bracelet. You should have been the author. Dun, dun, dun. Well, I like the author we got. I like him better. Oh, beer. You don't see that too often in a real glass. <laughs> but you often see Sydney drinking. Or recently drank. Oh. Drink. Blinded by my anger. Nothing rhymes with a anger. anger. <clears throat> There's so many skeletons. There's a lot of hearts, closet. too. Lots of hearts. Oh, interesting. I saw a, a deleted scene today. Oh, yeah? From, uh, from the Jefferson Frankenstein episode. Oh, really? Uh, where they go into Regina's like place with all the hearts. And I guess most of them were from Cora. Uh, Most of them weren't from Regina. That makes sense. Yeah, definitely. I don't know if that's still canon. Oh, oh here we go. Start singing the news. That's weird that they were from my country. Amazing. How did that happen? Finally. Or I can put you in this handy dandy mirror and take you with me. Skadoo into my handy dandy mirror. <laughs> Who's gonna do? We can't do. Sydney Skadoo, we can't do. <laughs> so he is from Agrava. Out of all the snakes How did her in all dad the world, get you the, had to walk into mine. <laughs> How did her dad get the Agrabah snakes? Um, There's world jumping involved there. Is there? Yeah, uh, there is probably, huh? Yeah. No, you never left me. Maybe like she magically turned regular snakes into Agrabah snakes? Maybe. It all comes out. Well, that's fine, Regina. I like her hair like this. I still don't like the shoulder pads, though. Well, no. I used you. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Nope. Mm -mm. Not with you this much eyeshadow. You don't have shadow. a lion tattoo. <clears throat> <gasps> See, I knew he didn't use the wish. <laughs> Boom. Shaka laka. The ultimate stalker mm -hmm. wishes himself into your life. I didn't mean this. I wanted to be your boyfriend. Forever and ever and ever. <laughs> Unless we break up. Ah. 
Uh-huh. Isn't that the round mirror, or it looks like the round well, mirror from the Snow two, Queen stuff? Two. Yeah. The curse of shattered sight. Shatter. Oh, good, another curse. Hey, look, an apple. A red, red apple. Regina with an apple? What? Mm hmm. Mm-hmm. Who didn't see that coming? I, I don't know if I should hold my hand up on that one or not. Who didn't see that coming? I saw that coming. I saw that coming. So, hand down. Inspired. <laughs> kind of dumb, though, considering he was riding in the car. Yeah. That could have gone bad. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, goodness. First Graham, now Sydney. What is it next? Archie? <laughs> Regina's playing the field on Once Upon a Time. <laughs> and we're done. Uh, that went quick. I enjoyed that. That was fun. It's been forever since I've seen that one. Literally forever. Literally forever. No, but a good, good time. As always, I thank you for joining us on this weird, uh, out there kind of ride through a Once Upon a Time episode. <laughs> Amory won't stop playing with her fan. That's fine. We'll just let her go. So, Amory, where can people find you online? You can find me on the Twitters at AMD Simone. And as for me, you can follow me on Twitter at Bill Meeks. You can follow all the podcasts we do at universebox.com. <laughs> And uh, let's see. Um, no, that's about it. I think we'll just call that it for now. We'll be back next week with uh, What Happened to Frederick, episode 13 of season one. Is that? Doing, doing a commentary on, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, right, so until it'll be a good time. next time. Until next time. Greetings, greetings from, from Storybrooke. Brooke. I love throwing him off with that.